2008, uh, me and a group of six other people went to the HMS Victory in Portsmouth. This is a big, big ball, a lot of history behind it. Now Tony Smith, the youth lead, one of the youth leaders at the time, it basically just won, was like, we're going to go on it, but it was £10 per ticket. So we thought, we thought, oh no, we're looking around it. The exit was unguarded at the time. So we snuck on through, through the back of the ship, had a full tour of the ship, then joined another tour, got, went back down, and when we came out, there was a guy with a clicker counting how many people went through. So that was funny. It was probably last year we were all faffing around throwing water bombs out the window and um, Andy Wood started throwing water bombs out of these other people and the police got involved and all that because it was littering and Andy Wood blamed it all on me, which is nice. I think it was 2006 when this guy called Tony Smith, someone you might know him, and um, like ringers and like Aaron Beckers, like loads of them, went to this fountain in the middle of Sheffield and like went over and like put a bit of bubble bath in and it was like this and it overflowed everywhere. Is that a word, overflow? Overflow everywhere. And it was like bubbling everywhere. It was really quite hilarious. So that was one funny moment from Audacious. Bedford um, smacked this guy's head with this massive, literally just, st he stood outside of the door and then he knocked on it and this little guy called Joe opened the door and Aaron uh, Bedford just went boom, poor kid, just flat on the floor, dead. Um, one of the best talks for me was, um, I don't think it was last year, I think it was the year before, um, Andy Elms was speaking about um, the secret place and the secret garden and the time that you spend with God and how that's really important um, to your relationship with him and um, it was just really good and it's something that I always remind myself of and different things in life remind me of that and it becomes something that becomes important to you from the talks that you hear and it's not just something that you hear like on a week and then that's it but it's something that stays with you for the rest of your life. Sophia Barrett did, a, did a, a talk about fear and it just really touched me and connected to me because it was just showing you that no matter what, God is always there for you and you can always fear things but if you've got God on your side then it'll just help you to get through them fears. You should go to Audacious if you want to find out what your purpose is in life. That's the place you will truly know. And after being to Audacious, you'll, you'll truly appreciate TCC a lot more because uh, you'll be able to grow in the house uh, taking away all the stuff that were taught to you at Audacious. That's why you, no, not you sat behind, you should go to Audacious. And if you don't go, I'll hunt you down. Oh uh, man, this toilet seat's warm, <laughs> it's nice and comfy. But yeah, that's why you should go to Audacious, yes.